In the last EDM video, I showed you my first burn with the new Pulse EDM and its explosion. The power resistors overheated and exploded. After I replaced the resistors, unfortunately, more was broken and after some troubleshooting, I had to replace a voltage regulator and the servo motor driver. Now I could finally start the next test. I made sure that the retraction would work in the case of a short and regularly tested the temperature of the resistors. After adjusting some parameters, everything looked quite nice and the burn was very powerful. The resistors became very hot and in the data sheet I read that they could only dissipate 50 watts of power with a heatsink. So that was the problem and I made very simple heat sinks for the power resistors. The next day I tried the so important narrow slits with 3 times 0.5 mm copper electrodes. The burn was very powerful and stable, what was one main reason for building the Pulse EDM. The power resistors didn't get too hot and I could eventually extensively test my new Pulse EDM. When I change the off time, nothing really happens. One problem I discovered was that the off time potentiometer has very little effect of the burn, what is quite strange and maybe something's wrong with my circuit. For me, the eroding process looked otherwise very good and was quite stable and powerful. After half an hour the slots were ready and the resistors weren't too hot. Everything worked fine and I was quite happy that I eventually can burn the needed slim slots for my heat exchangers. The next day I installed a thermometer to monitor the temperature of the power resistors and wanted to try a 3 times 0.6 graphite sheet electrode. I started the EDM, but nothing happened. The servo motor doesn't move. The servo driver was broken and I replaced it and added a heatsink. It should start, but... An in-depth troubleshooting revealed a broken timer IC LM555, which was responsible for the on and off times of the EDM process. Did I turn the machine off too quickly the day before and the ICs overheated without a fan? Was the timer IC LM555 defective before and does this explain the problem with the off time I had? I ordered a few new LM555 timer IC ICs and as a precaution some hex fats also. It will take a few days till they arrive and before I can check the EDM further. Hopefully it's not a bigger problem as the test burns were very successful. It's very annoying for an electronic newbie like me to search a failure in such a complex circuit. So I would be very happy for any commands and suggestions.